Samsung S3 Guru here, and here I am. This is a, a fairly short um, video, and this is reviewing the Samsung Galaxy S3 standard battery uh, replacement. Now, you say, well, why do you need to do a review on a freaking battery? And I'll tell you why. It has to do with the fact that I just want to just cover a couple of basic things uh, about these batteries just so that you're all set. First of all, this is the official Samsung uh, battery uh, with NFC, and that's the, that's something that you have to check. There's a bunch of batteries floating out there that don't have the NFC, the Near Field Communications, and that's a big deal because if you're planning on using Wi-Fi Direct, I'm sorry, not Wi-Fi Direct, but S Beam. If you're planning on using Google Wallet whenever it becomes available for Verizon, but everybody else is using it. Uh, if you're planning on using that um, the share where you put your phones together and you're sharing, it has to have the NFC capability. So you don't want to get a battery that does not have NFC. And what happens is, is that there's a, as I said, there's a bunch of batteries out there. I'm seeing them all the time that don't have the NFC, and people are getting confused because you're saying, oh, this one's $19 or $10 and there's another battery over here for six. I'm just going to get this one for six. How bad can it be? Well, probably the cheaper battery, the $6 battery does not have NFC. If they don't say, if they don't say NFC, then it doesn't have it. So you want to look for that. I've been just buying, um, I bought these on, on eBay and I'm finding if you search on eBay, or, or, or Amazon, you can find them just as cheap as the ones without NFC. And I think I bought four at six bucks or four at eight bucks or something like that. So that's not that bad. So I went and I did that. Now, the other question is people say, well, how do you charge them? Well, I've been actually, again, I went on eBay or, or uh, Amazon. I'm not sure which because I'm on vacation and I'm not really paying attention. And I got um, this little charger. And I think I paid $2.99 for this charger. And I actually, again, ended up buying like three or four of these uh, just because I you know take one leave one at the house take one and leave it here take one and leave it there and these th this particular charger you know things that I look for is that it's um, 110 240 because I travel a lot all I have to do is put the adapter on the end and I can still plug that in um, takes my battery just fine um, and it also has a USB so I can use it to charge a couple other things and on this one just something something that I noticed. Let me power off here before I read it. That's one of the things. I actually blew uh, a uh, phone by not turning it off. So I am now fairly religious about turning it off before I replace the battery. If it's frozen, um, certainly you don't have very many options. But if you do have the option to turn the phone off before you start pulling it out, uh, I would highly suggest you do so. Um, because you could um, you could damage it, and I'm not a real big warning person. So um, you actually can go ahead and you can pop that in. And the curious thing I found about this again, not a big deal. It fits through here. It hangs off over the side here, um, but that's by design, obviously, because it fits perfectly well over here. It you know fits in there nice and snug. Um, glows red while it's charging. Glows blue when it's done. And again, you can find these on um, on eBay or um, or Amazon, and they're fairly inexpensive. So the guru says, make sure if you don't go ahead and get the standard, which I'm, what I'm saying is, is you can just spend a few more minutes and just do a little bit more searching, and you can find an official um, battery with NFC, and just make sure that. It, and if you do go off brand, just make sure it has the NFC. Uh, get yourself a few of those. And I've got uh, I I've, I've been getting away with three a day. Um, again, I do a lot of stuff that's probably more than most of you might do, but I need like three of these a day. So what I I charge them up at night, and uh, I swap through them, and and I go through, and I it's I'm I'm up and about from like nine o'clock in the morning till about three o'clock in the morning. So that's that's what's going on there. Um, so I would say get yourself a standard battery, get yourself a um, uh, a little charger. I will be reviewing some of these extended batteries. I'm just waiting for the review units to come in and I'll be giving you a review on those. As always, I will end off by saying please, please, please download the Samsung S3 Guru app from the store um, for a couple of reasons. One, it gives you all the information. It's right in the app. The app is um, has the reviews in it. The app has the um, 
tutorials in it. I'm going to be putting more specific exclusive content that will only be available through the app. And of course it has that little that little thing of advertising down the bottom, but that's the only way I'm getting reimbursed at this particular point. So the more of those that are out there, when is Tenny is downloading the app, that that ain't so hot. When there's a thousand people, hey, okay, fine. So if I make three bucks a day, uh, then my wife doesn't yell quite so much. Okay, Samsung S3 Guru saying, I'm out of here. <laughs>